Hi guys, Dave Foster from Team Hazard RC here. Um, thought I'd do a real quick follow-up video um, off the back of Alex Greaves video, I'd Be Crazy, the other day. Um, the live video he had showing the Crossfire standard antennas mounting against carbon fibre mini quad frames. Um, I fly wings, so I thought I would bring my Crossfire antennas in. I've got diversity module. Um, and for the micros, I run the um, Immortals. Um, for the extra few bucks, I think it's well worth investing in what I would consider to be a much better quality antenna um, with the bracing that holds it all in the correct orientation and position and all the rest of it. Um, so I'll flip around now to the spec end. So what I've got is my coil dipole off the back of the diversity di uh, receiver. Um, when I hooked it up, it was sitting around about 900 meg as a center freak. So around about there. Now it's not terrible. Um, it would work pretty good for both the 868 and the 915. Um, because I use 915, what I thought I'd do is trim it accordingly. So I ended up taking around about three mil off, and I've done it to three of them now, and they're all about the same. And just for a reference, I'm going to go off the top of oh, the top of the base, um, rather than trying to work out exactly where the middle is. So you're looking at 46. And a half, 46.95, or what's that, 1.84, 1.84 inch. They've all come up the same. Um, they've all come smack on 9.15. You can see the return loss there's, you know, sort of between 20, 23. Um, that means that you're about 99.5% efficient with the antenna so for 100 milliwatts you're radiating 99 and a half of those milliwatts um, on the 815 at the moment so 815 is sitting up at about four and a half so at, at the moment this antenna is pretty rubbish on 868 so once you trim it it's trimmed um, you obviously can't get it back so and four four and a half five db you're only looking at about 60 percent efficiency so um, you know again if this was a transmit antenna instead of a receive um, out of 100 milliwatts you'd only be transmitting about 60 ish milliwatts and the other 40s reflected back down um, so that's effectively what that is. Now the other thing um, which is a really good demonstration was carbon fibre is not a friend of RF. So as you mount it on your mini quad, things change. EPP and EPO is not so much a problem. So if you are on 915, I would recommend trimming the antennas down. That little bit extra um, could mean that little bit extra difference if you're doing long range. Um, it's not going to affect it. Having it mounted in the EPP, normally just pop a hole and that keeps the correct orientation and polarization as well. Um, and it'll be similar for your transmit antenna. Um, I'm not sure what wire is used, it sort of looks like the brake line off a BMX bike or something. Um, so anyway, when I get a replacement or when I get some cable and I can knock up a, a new dipole, I will do that. So anyway, hope this has been helpful. Um, so for all you wing guys using either Immortals or the Diversity, um, 1.84 inch or about 47 mil and that will make a fair difference to your antenna performance. Hope it's been helpful. Catch you later.